Question 12. Amir says, all numbers that end in a 4 are multiples of 4. Is he correct? Circle yes or no. Explain how you know. If all you do is circle yes or no without any explanation, even if you're, you're right and you pick the correct one, you'll get no marks if you haven't put an explanation. So it's really important that we make some attempt to explain how we've got our answer. So let's have a look at numbers that end in a 4. Well, you can obviously have 4. You can have 14, 24, 34, 44, 54, 64. You could go on further, but we don't need to go any further than that, really. Multiples of 4 go 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36, 40. Now all we need to do, he's saying that all the numbers that end in a 4 are multiples of 4. If we can just find one number that ends in a 4 that isn't a multiple of 4, then we prove that he isn't correct because he's saying all of them are. So let's start checking the list. Well, 4, if we start at the top, 4 is a multiple of 4. 14. Now, 14 is not in our multiple of 4 list. So straight away, we found an example that proves that he is not correct. So the answer is no. He isn't correct because not all of the numbers that end in a 4 multiple of 4, because 14 is not a multiple of 4. If you want to get a few extra examples, 24 is a multiple of 4. But 34 isn't, okay, because 34 is not in this list. Now all you need to do for your explanation is to say which examples you've found that prove he's wrong. So explain how you know, and you can say this, 14 and 34 end in a 4, but they are not in the four times table and that would be a sufficient answer you wouldn't even need to give both of them as long as you can find one at number that's ended a four that's not in the four times table you would prove that he is not correct